Good morning everybody. Today is Sunday the 6th. Just looking at one piece watch. I've done a video this morning with Frankie so I should know the date. Is it the 6th today, Russ? According to my advent calendar, it's the 10th. According to his advent calendar, it's the 10th. <laughs> I think I'm a bit ahead of the game. <laughs> I think <laughs> that you might run out of chocolates, Russ. <laughs> so we're um, heading on over now to the uh, bungalow. Woohoo! I haven't been over the bungalow for a month. The last time I videoed for you guys is the last time that I went to the bungalow. And I had a message from Diamond Granny um, asking if, a comment, sorry, not a message, a comment, asking if we still have the same like lovely areas to walk in. Uh, yes, our bungalow is about, how far is it, Russ? About 20 minutes away from where we live now? Yeah. About 20 minutes away from where we live now still in the same like areas the same country and um, country county <laughs> same country area so yes there are still lovely lovely walks all around us i'll film some of that now on the way Here we are. Cathedral's coming on nicely. <laughs> it's so exciting! So exciting! Haven't been here for a month. Get that view. There. Peeping through there. So there's our neighbours, two houses there. We've got a neighbour here with chickens. And a couple of houses up there. That's it. So definitely plenty of walks around here. So exciting. <sighs> wow, we can see a path. We can see a path. We need the top to this stone. These are staddle stones. We need the to top to it. People nick the tops because these are really expensive stones. Um, that's the reason why the house is called Staddles. It's so tidy out here now, isn't it? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Let's find Millie. Millie, where are you? There. We're up here, look. Down. Oh, look, it's got all of the plaster on folks <gasps> wow oh, thanks Russ now you're burping farting in the last weekend burping this weekend I'm sure I'll have a fart in a minute wow look at that oh my god so big it's so lovely so what are we waiting for the underfloor heating to go on top of this yeah, it's experiment, so we're going to see. Oh, right, okay, let's That's go. This is here. What? The there, the oh, is this underfloor heating? Yeah. Oh, it doesn't that have like coil things? The pipe's going there. That's oh. like, that's what goes there first, the pipe. That's the pipes there. Where? In those boxes there. there. What boxes? Oh, there, yeah. yeah. And they, they, is that a pipe there? Yeah, 
No. No? No. It's just a plastic pipe. I oh, remember your sister put in underfloor heat in an hour. Yeah, this is the Oh, yes, your sister put in. Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, right. Russ's sister is very um, electrical minded as well. Hey, we're going to the nursery, guys. <gasps> Getting the underfloor heating in. Woohoo, in the nursery. Pipes go up and then they go around and bend up there, come back, bend and go back, back up there. Oh, fantastic. Oh, here's the, uh, this is going to be in my nursery. Well, it'll be in the cupboard and the wardrobe, by the way. That's so here, isn't it? Yeah, I know that. I know that. Yeah, it's going to be ward, there's going to be shelves all along there. This is what I did yesterday to get it so pretty. Uh, that's what on. you did, is it? Wow. It'll wear it up. So then when they come, when they get this down there in a week, they just turn it on and we've got heat in there. Guys, oh my god, I'm so excited! Ah! <laughs> the baby's gonna have a lovely view, aren't they? Oh, they're all gonna be sat at the window at night. They're not gonna be going to bed in their cot. Yeah, they're gonna be Okay. There we go. It looks so much bigger now. It's had the. Um, it painted. It has the plaster on it. It looks so much bigger. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. You make this paint it look bigger again. It's not a small room. Not a big room. It's definitely not a big room. It doesn't look like a cathedral. It's not quite as big as a garage, but I've got a, I've got a bloody washing machine, tumble dryer, and a utility at the garage, and all the tools to prepare your camper. Smallest. All the tools to repair your room. Smallest yeah. violin all out ever. Of my garage. Smallest violin ever. Oh, so here's our bedroom. Wow, all our underfloor heating. Wow, oh, so that split there has been plastered. That's our ensuite. Oh, and this wall. Wow, oh my God, I'm so excited. Mm hmm, mm hmm. This will be the shower. I know, Millie. It's exciting, isn't it? We've got a new house. Yay! Go on, then. Here you go. Oh, look at it. Oh, my God. Oh, got all the holes in for the lights. So we're having little recessed lights going all the way along there. Is that a few weeks ago? Yeah, I haven't been here for a month. Yeah, uh, right, uh, that's ready to go. Wow. Oh my god, it's so exciting, everybody. So there's a front door. And there is the humongous space for the patio door. When does that come? Not till January. Um, yeah, we've had a little bit of a delay on that. Yeah. Yeah. And I think they're going to do something temporary in their bedroom so they can get the garage watertight. Yep. And cut that out. You put the windows in mid January, both those windows are going. So the only windows we're changing are these two, these, we're adding one, changing one. We're changing that one? It's not no, changing. No, no, the one in the garage. Oh, the one, little the hole in the garage, garage. yeah. Well, and our bedroom. Garage. Well, the toilet in the garage, the window, I mean, the garage is going to have our bedroom window put in it. Mm hmm. Or the bedroom that's been in the garage. Mm -hmm. And the old patio door's been in the garage. Mm -hmm. And a new patio door and a new patio door. And a new patio door. Yeah, we're having, um, is it French doors or patio doors? Patio doors. Patio doors in our bedroom, guys. Let's go back and have a look at that. So, oh, I can see now. It's been knocked out. I didn't even notice that. So that's. I didn't even notice that. That was like, it, that was like it, way before you came last time. Yeah, but I think I noticed now because yeah. it's the floors down and there was a load of stuff in the middle of that. Ready to come out, really, and then put a patio door, which will slide one way, slide that way. Yeah. So we've got a big empty space for floor ceiling. That's this side. Woohoo! Oh my God, we're so lucky. Careful not to accidentally fall out. <laughs> You're such a get. I'm going to set fire to his cathedral. Oh, I've made a lovely handrail for outside it. You can lean on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. 
is so excited. Yeah, so there's been a delay on the patio door, so that won't be here till January. And there's a delay, is there a delay on something else that were you telling me? Something else should have been started, but it hasn't been started yet. Is that the floor? Is the floor later? Yeah, we're hoping to get this floor down this week. That's it, yeah, yeah. the floor. We're yeah, hoping to get the, all this stuff down and the pipes in this week. But the bloody floor plan was a problem. They came without a floor plan, didn't they? The company who does it is meant to produce a floor plan and say where it all goes because they, yeah. they, they didn't send the plan with it. The plumber didn't know what to put So the plumber didn't know what to, what to put where? Gets, aren't they? Well, they have done that. And then they sent the wrong one. And they sent the wrong one. Yeah, Catch up with this week. I don't think it's taking all the book down. Once they start putting the stuff down, it won't take long to get down. Yeah, no, it's pretty, it's That's like. All the floor has been leveled off. This is all over where the floor has been leveled off. Yeah. So it's already. Oh, Matt has done such a brilliant job. Matt has really. I'm so. I'm so happy with how it's come on, Russ. Are you? I am, yeah. Really... It feels, it has a really nice feel about it as well. And to think if you. This is going to be lovely, yeah. Yeah, because we weren't going to... This here, these where I'm stood now and where that is were the bedrooms previously. So I do have this all in a playlist. So go and, you can go and look at the very first video and you'll see how it was laid out before we did anything. But um, what we were going to do was where Russ is heading up towards now in the what is going to be my nursery, my doll room, was the kitchen. Where Russ has stood now was a bathroom, then a bedroom, a bedroom, and where our bedroom is was the lounge area. And we were thinking about the best way of getting light into here and making an open plan. We both love open plan. And so we were like, actually, if we knock down the walls between here, this will make a whole big open plan area and the sun will come through there in the, in the day. And if we opened up this side as well, we'd have more light. And that's, um, so that's how come we've got it and it's done. We have got our own personal post box. <laughs> Railings definitely do need to come down. They look really shabby and horrible, don't they? Yeah, well, I've got something up there. Russ is going to do... No, I know. We're going to get moved in. That's yeah, the main thing, is to get in. Yeah. What we're going to... Do, what we're doing is we are going to... Our aim is to get in, and then outside... Anything outside, we can work on then, can't we, Russ? So, like, my, my shed for my um, prams and bits that I like to have outside... Russ is going to build a shed, so I know it would be, like, really, really good. And things like the railings. What else would we... Oh, the down the bottom, we're making another... Utility worktop. Utility worktop? Work oh, yeah, we're having a worktop in the utility. No, I mean, down the bottom, what I was saying, we're having another drive, aren't we? Yeah. And yeah, our yeah. car parking space. Let's we'll see what... what Eventually. Price. I'm waiting to get the price back to move that gas thing there. That could be quite expensive as another way. Yeah, no, I know, that's what I'm saying. We just want to get in, but there are then jobs that we want to do when we're in. Like downstairs, the guest room is not going to be done. Probably won't be done until spring because that'll be the last, that's the last thing on our list. The main thing on our list is to get in, get Russ's garage done so he's got all of his stuff in there and get the house done because then we can move and rent out our property and reclaim some money back. Isn't that right, Russ? <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so so excited. I am so so excited and I'm so thankful that to have this. This has been like a dream for me. Um ever since I found out about my fibro. My dream has been to get a bungalow. Everything on one floor. Because, you know, if you've watched me for a long time, you'll know that I was told that I would be in a wheelchair by, by now, but I'm not. So that has always been my plan in life. However, how I was going to get there, I never knew. Because, you know, I was teaching, I had three girls. Then I met Russ again. Woohoo! <laughs> and 
we thought we'd find our forever home. And we have found it. I'm so thankful. I feel so blessed. And emotional about it. I don't take any of it for granted. Russ has worked so hard all his life. And yeah, I take the mickey out of him about him having his like massive, massive man cave that's the same size as our bungalow. Probably is the same size my daughter my eldest daughter lives in a bungalow. Probably the same size as her whole bungalow. But he has worked hard all his life. I don't think I, I don't think Russ has ever taken a sick day, maybe twice in his whole working life. <laughs> so I definitely don't take it for granted. And I'm so looking forward to it. We both are. We're both so looking forward to it. So I stood in the nursery and that is the view from the nursery. Gosh. Thank you, Lord. And then I'll pan around, show you the state of the balcony, the patio. <laughs> and the patio, now we've got the garage up, doesn't look as, as big. I thought it was like really big and obnoxious when we first stood out there. But now we've got the garage up, it actually looks small. But there goes the cathedral is going up really well. Let's go and have a look at that. Your turn will come. Your turn will come. Millie's waiting because she knows we've got her lead in the van. Because we are going to take her to the beach. Just having some time together. So here we go. Let's go in and see how this has got on. Wow. Well, it's wet in here. Over here. Hey. Over here. <laughs> you need a loud speaker. You need a, a surround sound. Wow. That has really, really come on, hasn't it? So will something go up above that so they won't show? Or will they no, show? No, this will, be, this will be ceiling in now. There'll be five glass above that and it will look like and then it's going to be plywood ceiling. So that'll just be a void up there. Just an attic void. But we're not going to use it to store stuff because we've got plenty of room down below. So it'll just be... Just oh, definitely more. plenty. I mean, when I look at those things you've made out the back, those yeah, your your, shade, your your workbenches, I'm like, that looks like dollhouse size when you come in here. They're lost in here, aren't they? Yeah, they are. They're going to look completely lost. That means I need to buy more then. Oh, so this is so again. This is where the ensuite is going. That's not the ensuite. Well, it's not the ensuite. It's a shower. Shower shower, shower room. room. Yeah. And that's the window yeah, for that. Washing machine sink. Dishwasher, um, tumble, here, tumble dryer, washing machine, machine, tumble dryer, and the sink. Yeah. But it's a really small sink, guys. Ross has got it outside at the back. There's his patio door, so he can enjoy the view from his man cave when he's got his man friends here. Look at that view! Oh my god! Jeez. And I was just saying, Russ, that our patio, when we first did it, I thought, God, it looks so obnoxious. And I was saying, like, it looks really obnoxious and, like, look at us. But now we've got the walls up to the garage. It actually looks small. It's about right, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah. small now. <laughs> you want any smaller because it is our garden, isn't it? Yeah. Because you're not going to keep walking down there, are you? No, this definitely garden, not. So. Definitely not because there are going to be steps from here to go down round. And my shed, this is Russ's window to the view, and my shed is going to be down there, which Russ is going to build, so it's going to be, br oh, sorry, love, it's going to be brilliant. It's, it's going to be perfect. Bit. So I'm going to have a shed there that's going to hold all my, like, prams and my outside bits for my reborns. And, like, there's going to be grass there, but I'm saying that to Russ, I might want to have a little bit of a gravel, so, like... I can bring my reborns down there and I can get their little bikes and things out. But look at the view. Oh, it's so lovely. Wow, Russ, hey? Wow. Russ's dream. My dream. We're having our dreams made, love. Our dreams are being made. Because you work so hard. 
And you have such an annoying wife. Yeah. <laughs> Bring you the second bit of that. <laughs> oh, we wouldn't have been able to do, do this without Night Electrical. Well, we would have, but we would have been in debt. There we go, folks. There we go, folks. I hope you've enjoyed um, seeing the update. I know some people do like to see the update, and if you don't, that's fine. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.